Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to be looking at Raves Diva Nail Polish, her new collection. It is the artist collection. Her grandmother was a phenomenal painter and she painted um, portraits and uh, landscapes and everything and most of it was on is Indian reservations. And so she took her inspiration from the paintings that her, she have she has of her grandmother or that her grandmother did I worded that completely wrong uh, I'm gonna show you the paintings that she took inspiration from and all the polishes I hope you enjoy it and this one is combing tangles and here it is and this is three coats and a top coat it is a jelly base and it's just a really pretty light green with all kinds of hollow and gold little shimmers and flakes and well, no, not flakes, just glitters, I guess. But the impressive part, she put three balls in it. That's right. Not two, but three. <laughs> that maybe shows a little better. Next is this gorgeous blue, Arian's Tears. And here's the painting that she got the inspiration for this one from. And I am going to swatch them all. Wow, Tara, I got that one out without open without a rubber band. This is a beautiful blue and it has some little red shimmers and glitters. And this is why I hate doing these bottle shots because I'm getting polish on my bottle. Most of these are jelly bases, and I'm going to give you a little clue. People say, oh, I don't like jelly base. Um, you know, it takes too many coats to build it up. Here's the reason. Because if you've ever swatched a polish that is super, that has all these pretty glitters and all this pretty stuff in it, and it's very opaque in the first coat, um, that opaqueness of the polish then covers up your pretty shimmers and glitters so that's why they kind of need to be a little jelly based but if you have an issue with that my solution is just to take a polish that's near the color and this one's a stamping polish but you know you're gonna get the idea and make your base coat that color and then it'll only take you like one or two layers on top of that to make that completely opaque if you don't have time or don't want to mess with uh four coats okay now that one i think would have been okay with two coats this one took three and i probably could have done another one and this one is Watchful Spirits, and this one, oh wow, I mean it, it just has shimmer so it's not so jelly, but look how beautiful, one coat, look how beautiful that was, it is just such a pretty gray with blue shimmer. Oh, I love that. This one is Desert Friends. And it also is in a jelly base, and you'll see why. Do you see all that stuff in there? It's got little black and um, a lot of blue shimmer, and the base is like it's orange. Oh, that's so pretty.
and I just so happened to have some burnt orange of hers um, from another fall collection that I missed, but um, someone was kind enough to send me a little a bottle of it. But that is your base or another burnt orange. And but this one built up pretty good. Look how pretty. Oh my gosh. I mean, I wouldn't even want to cover that with stamping. Really. Next up we have the cowboy. This one is, oh, a really pretty gold. And it has, um, I don't know, some really fine hollow shimmers and glimmers and glitters and so pretty. Um, so far, none of these have been, I don't like texture, and I've not found, none of these have been, like, textured where a top coat was absolutely, positively necessary. So I like this shiny finish. Look how pretty that is. It's just gorgeous. Even though it's on my fingers and I did not clean it up, I'm going to go ahead and show you coming tangles. Um, I really think this would make a really nice just hollow top coat all over that gold or anything really. But I'm going to put a little bit of a coat of a different green on the back side. And the last one is Roper. And it is a beautiful red. <laughs> that was Penny. <laughs> I think she's bored with me right now. Oh, wait till you guys see the end. Um, Penny was in... She was on CNN this morning. Did you see her? <laughs> I recorded it. <laughs> they took her picture off, off of Instagram and put it on CNN. Anyway, here's Roper. Really pretty one coat. I mean, that built up um, amazingly well. Better than I thought it was going to. So pretty. Ooh, that's a heavy coat guy, this is. Because you guys don't want to sit around and watch me paint sticks. Alright, so there they are, all are. What do you guys think? I think they're really pretty. Uh oh. Watchful Spirits was trying to sneak away there. I love them all. Um, so if you like these and you would like to try them, please follow the links below. All right, support the indies, you guys. Um, yeah, thumbs up, subscribe. Tell me what's your favorite down below. Bye. Oh, stay tuned. Watch Penny. One million people who like to shame their dogs. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Well, it turns out that the younger you are, the more likely that you're going to be somebody who's going to be doing it. And a lot of them are marked down today. Huh? It's so Penny. She's on CNN. Hands. How um, cool is that? Survey says, what do you think are the most...
at the little chicken. Oh my god, the cow is so cute. We just ran upon these. <laughs> That's perfect. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> Her lips cracked me up. Is he gonna get you? He gonna get you? Oh.